following is an example of a public profile that we've, we at Vitae have created for Mike Barilla uh, without any real substantive um, interview or survey being done with Mike uh, that could bring us um, 3x this, this type of material. But it's an example of how we add relations to an individual to provide a, a real, at least a foundation for, the, for a digital representation of the footprint um, an individual has through life. Let's start with schools attended and we go to the attended tab and uh, see that Mike uh, started out at Regis Jesuit in Aurora, Colorado, went on to Stanford University and the Stetson uh, University College of Law ultimately. Uh, as far as athletics, uh, he was a multi-sport athlete at, at Jesuit playing football, playing basketball, and uh, we'll get the exact seasons. Um, but those would have been, uh, uh, I think football would have actually been 68 and 69 for basketball would have been his senior uh, years. So we'll get the rest of them in there. Went on to freshman football and freshman basketball. Actually came to Stanford on a basketball scholarship. Went on to, to play for multiple years starting the 72 and 73 seasons. Went on um, after being drafted, I believe, by Cincinnati. Went on to uh, uh, play for the Eagles and then uh, finished up his, uh, his career uh, with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers under John McKay. Uh, walking away from the game because of injury concerns and just disillusionment in general with the NFL. Um, if we look at his uh, various groups that he belongs to, we've got a lot of things here that involve his demographic information, his beliefs, his... Uh, uh, fraternity affiliations, his family um, uh, information as far as siblings, uh, his professions, his uh, astrological uh, signs, his occupations, undergraduate uh, major, um, numerology, you name it. So we've got him in 23 different groups without having even done a thorough survey. Uh, if you look at some of the awards, honors, and achievements that Mike has had, he was uh, a winner of the Irving Zimmer Award as the MVP of the Stanford football team. Uh, in high school, his, his uh, maybe most prominent honor was that of the Gold Helmet from the Denver Post, one of the few awards Mike's actually held on to, uh, having uh, taken many of his awards and giving them um, off to support one of his favorite charities. He was a uh, first-team all-conference player in 1973. He would ultimately be named to the Stanford All-Century team in 1991 uh, as a quarterback, having uh, originally started as a wide receiver on the football team and then get uh, convinced to, to move to quarterback. So Mike, um, surprisingly, having maybe been a better basketball player than football player, went on to uh, to play in the NFL. He was drafted in, with the 87th pick in 1974. He would make the Pro Bowl in 1975, throwing two touchdowns to help lead the NFC uh, to a, uh, a victory in the final uh, moments, which was pretty exciting. Oh, I should also point out that he was a member of the Playboy preseason All-American team in 1973. So uh, if we then look at... Um, where he's worked, uh, we haven't gone to all, all the places he worked as an attorney or as a uh, real estate professional, um, uh, actually mortgage banker, uh, but he did serve for 25 years on the board of Shannon's Hope, which is a um, uh, maternity uh, support uh, women's group, uh, nonprofit in the Denver area. Anyway, this uh, gives you an idea not only of the information we can compile on someone like Mike, but it then puts him into a completely connected online presence with other people that share a uh, similar background, whether it be uh, members of the uh, Stanford Delt House, uh, where he was in, in a fraternity. We, we could immediately, with just one click, find the other... Uh, 202 uh, members of the uh, Delta Tau Delta Stanford University chapter that have a, a connected online presence on Vitae, your sports. So that should give you an idea uh, of, the, of what we can do without having even tried. That we'll move on to, uh, to actually getting some of the, the 
more uh, nuanced elements of, of Mike's profile through a personal interview.